good. Hey, what is up guys, Wizzle here, and today I have once again mind-blowing information for you guys. Trust me, be sure to watch the video all the way until the end in order to, yeah, understand it. But guys, without further ado, let's get straight into this. So first of all, a big, big shout out to Dibis Gaming. He is making some insane mystery videos lately, he comes up with the sickest theories and the information he shares in his videos is just, yeah, mind blowing. A link to his channel will be in the description below, so check him out guys, show him some love and yeah, the information. First off, let's start with something funny. Everything is about having the right angle guys. <laughs> As you can see here, there appears a giant cock if you look at it from the right angle. So yeah, that's pretty cool to start off with. Maybe there are more of these, um, yeah, how do we call this? Optical illusions or something? I don't know, maybe there are more of them. Moving on to some mysterious billboards in GTA 5. Have any of you guys ever seen this billboard before? Well, I did, but only in GTA 5. It seems that this billboard is also displayed somewhere else, in an alien movie. This movie is about alien lizards that are living among us on Earth and they are controlling us through secret messages. Do you guys see the sign in the background? Take a look at the following clip, guys. And remember the sign. So basically the dude from the movie found a pair of glasses that revealed the hidden messages and aliens or lizards that are living among the people. In the movie all high positioned people in the society put messages in our head through TVs, billboards, etc. And in the clip you could see him looking at a billboard. Without glasses it is yeah, just a normal billboard you would say, but through the glasses it changes completely. But yeah, talking about these alien slash lizard people, it is not the first time we hear from these um, people. Well, I know they are not people, but you get the idea. Ron actually talks about these people on his radio show. Here, take a listen. In the movie, these aliens have a secret underground facility and tunnel system. This is because there are rumors going on in real life actually that there are living these lizard people in the sewers of Los Angeles. So yeah, that's pretty cool. But why are we talking about all this, I hear y'all ask? Well, because of the following guys. In the movie, some camo dudes are guarding a secret tunnel, but what are they holding? Exactly guys, a spectrometer. Like what the fuck, I thought it was something GTA 5 exclusive, but nope. So in the movie they use this device to check if the people are coming to the tunnel to yeah, check if these people are real people or aliens. And guys, isn't that the exact same as what we use the spectrometer in GTA 5 for? As far as we know, we only have two spectrometers in GTA 5. But guys, there is a third one. Listen up. <gasps> Do your worst, you'll never find the spectrometer. So, the first spectrometer is belonging to the Epsilon program and is attached to Michael. Michael gets to use this one in one of the Epsilon missions where he needs to search for 
I don't know, some crazy Epsilon stuff. So that's the first spectrometer and that's yeah where it first appears in the game. The second spectrometer is belonging to Omega and if you yeah need to attach this to a single player character it would be Franklin because yeah Omega is attached to Franklin because only Franklin can do uh, Omega's missions. So then you would say the third and final one is belonging to something that is attached to Trevor, right? Listen carefully, guys. Do your worst. You'll never find the spectrometer. So the third spectrometer is belonging to the Eltris camp. And guys, what is attached to the Eltris camp? Correctly, Trevor. Only Trevor can bring and sacrifice people to the camp. And Trevor is the only character that the Eltris camp people do not attack. It even makes sense. Remember the whole Morse code of the Eltris camp with Lord Zapfo and the alien and all that? Well, the Eltrist use the spectrometer to check if someone is an alien because they are sacrificing people to praise Lord Zapfo, who is coming to reclaim the earth, if you need to believe him. So this is a huge breakthrough if you ask me, all thanks to Debus Gaming. But there is more. According to the movie, there are tunnels here. So many sources are telling us there are hidden tunnels in the game. Like there are even rumors from in real life as well that there are these secret tunnel systems in their, yeah, Los Angeles. And we all know Rockstar just loves to play with these kind of rumors and turn them into reality in their own way. So who knows, maybe we find a tunnel, maybe we can open the T01 door, or maybe if we open up the door behind the mirror, it takes us to a tunnel, everything is possible. But first, we need to find this third spectrometer. I am 100% certain the Eltros camp people have this third spectrometer or have something to do with it. I mean, it makes a lot of sense. Think about it. The Epsilon program has the first device. The only Michael exclusive or Michael only missions that are suspicious are the missions from the Epsilon program. Then Omega. Omega has the second device. The only suspicious um, yeah, missions that are Franklin exclusive only are the Omega missions. And then of course we have the Eltros camp and the third device, what we still need to find. The only Trevor only missions that are suspicious are the Eltris camp missions so yeah it just makes so much sense if you think about it so yeah guys if you can do some investigation here share the video with as many people as you can we really need to get this out there because I truly believe this is it like oh my god this makes so much sense Guys, let's go for 1000 likes on the video. The video is amazing, the information is just insane and it is information where we actually can do something with. So every single person, please do me a favor, smash the like button and yeah, I would really appreciate it. Share the video around, let me know what you all think of this in the comment section below, share your theories, just everything. Also, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to keep updated and I'm out guys, bye. Hoochie.